fine. We're going to talk about how to make user-specific views in this Coda tip so that people know exactly where mine lives. And the good news is you don't need to make a bunch of views for every person. You can make one and it's automatically set up so everyone can have their stuff exactly where they want it to be. So here I have a task table, right? We've got some projects, some tasks, and noticed they're assigned to various people. So what I'm going to do is go over here on the right. I'm going to make a new page and I'm going to call it mine. And yeah, pickaxe, that seems fun. Why not? And I'm going to add a table. And instead of making a new blank table, I'm going to have this one be connected to the tasks table. So I'm making a view. So now if I update here or if I update back in that home table, it doesn't matter where, all changes automatically go to both places. And now I'm going to call this table my tasks. Let's give ourselves a little bit of space here. And I'm going to go here to filter and I'm going to add a filter where the owner is equal to the current user. I just checked that little box. And now notice it automatically filters and only shows me my things. Mine. You can't touch them. These are mine. You can't have them. Now, if you were to log into this task table, you would only see the tasks assigned to you. If your friend were to log in, they'd only see theirs. So this makes it really easy for us to just tell people, hey, if you're looking for your stuff, go to the My Task page and it's automatically set up. And the other nice thing is you don't have to make table after table after table for every person on your team. You just make one table, one view, one filter, and you're on your way to having everything where you want it, just like so. This is mine.